Production in action. <laughs> Because of the matchup that they're playing against, because as you look at it, it's like not this very obvious Omni Knight pick. Show your versus the Void, which can always be really beneficial. But Limitless he's a lot about like debuffing assign. and dispelling things nowadays. Even though he's not played too often, that is what he is uh, played for. So it's interesting. I you know, yeah, I think Alliance is just easier to play. But you know, I know for everybody watching, this is Alliance for Secret. Secret, of course, very favorable in this matchup. But overall, from drafts, yeah, Alliance they have a really easy way to take team fights. Secret just looks a little bit more complicated, but. Not like theirs doesn't synergize either. No, absolutely. But we'll, we'll see what Alliance is able to bring out here. You know, we heard it from Nico Baby before the game. You know, they did have a tough previous series, but they're ready yeah. to come into this one, sort of shake it's it up, get back in. Finally, Alliance going to win. This current roster. I yeah, I want to see how, I really want to look at these lanes. Like, I, everybody's going to look at the mid lane, probably is the most important one. The Kunkka versus Puck. Kunkka tends to do very well in that matchup, and Nisha, especially, is one of those That's masters of the Kunkka. So I'm going to be mostly watching that lane. But yeah, lanes, I think, it's really late game, we just swing, yeah. As soon as we don't get to roll over again. Okay like, can it just, can it be like one game that's not 40 like, minutes and we're like 6k behind? Just one game. Try lane, get Timber in a matchup versus Beast so he can have this super good advantage going into mid lane. And it lo does look like they're going to do that. Timber's going bottom, with two supports playing around top with the Void. Okay. It is scouted. Of course, Secret yep. does have some wards there, but yeah, and we're seeing both lanes. Secret's going to do the same, yeah. They're going to take Rezo up to the top lane. Trying to get some good matchups, so... I, like Secret already sees it, so Secret's getting the matchups they want. All right, we had some to... Nah, how, how Look at though. He's actually cutting Bump through the trees up. top. So maybe like trying to avoid a ward to not give them the vision, the fact that he's actually... Yeah, there is a there. void okay. in the game. Now they see it, so let's see where the... the change I, yeah, how is. musical are these games going to be? They oh, are no, not the same thing they're, again. They're really trying to get these matchups. The Timber versus the Beast, the Void versus that Razor, because Razor versus the Timber... Okay, we get the lane we want. Nothing. You get static lane, you just jump away. Yeah, see, was it if, if you see that you put the extra effort in, into moving again or against Timber? Now, how important is it for you that you do try and force that advantage, adv advantageous matchup in this lane? I think they're going to keep it like this. Just, I okay. think they're very happy with the position of these lanes because now you have this Boom. Beast versus Timber, where Timber's going to be very happy up here, oh. but Beast will be able to get stuff as well down here, and then you have a Razor versus Void. Being like, Void, sure, you can have these situations where you break Link, but this does sound like it could be pretty hard. This will be yeah, extremely it painful. It a couple ways to at least break it. That's true, actually. That for secrets. Yeah. Could certainly make the difference, because indeed on its own, time walk sometimes can definitely be chased down by a razor. Mm -hmm. See on the, the mid lane indeed so far. And pretty much even on the... It's just got a couple of... a little lag, it's fine. To deny and a last hit either way. Uh, mid is going good. 7-2. Sure I mean, th this game, they've got some fantastic setup, of course. Alliance. There's no way you can they shift. They have great team fight. Yeah. Like, it's just straightforward from the lineup. I mean, it's, it's going to be a lot easier than we were saying for them kind of hard, execute, though. But He's going to bait so hard. Taking this is going to be pretty crazy, too. The Omni, the Kunkka, the Rump. Alright, he's fire. fine. Fire, fire. He's actually going to be able to fine. survive there. They couldn't quite get the last bit of damage in. It's okay, no, it's blood okay. To be had yet. No, Don't fucking lose your lanes again. I mean, Puppy was ready to try and get it. He has, has that hammer of purity ready to throw in that extra bit of damage. It's got to be very close for that, though. It's a little too early for airplane. They're going to go aggressive. Games. They're on crystal. a little early. Oh, bash. We'll and then bash. Damage here for Nico, baby. He's Never lucky. Slow down. We'll have to turn his attention over towards Puppy. Of course, doesn't want to use his time walk aggressively there. Too close to the tower. One, maybe even one bash could have gotten the kill there. Two for sure. That was actually... Very close, and they stopped the pull. That's the important thing. Puppy was getting a side pull. The lane is getting a bit stabilized, so not bad down here. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. And middle winning and top winning. Mid puck this time. I mean, it's obviously going to be the Witchblade, but I know we we've been talking in the back room. Which one? Been seeing the chainmail. <laughs> super physical damage mid lane. Oh, no. yeah, yeah, he wants kill. some type of armor to offset this. Massive damage is coming out from them. Yeah, we're seeing already how much damage we are having to tank, but yep. yeah, he's keeping it cool, and, and CS continues to be very even. Yep, and he's okay. got a small camp, so he's starting to pull forward a little bit. Nisha does have his available, too, so he'll gonna, he's going to probably start doing the same the camp soon. with Q. Yeah, this is impossible. Nobody, nobody being left out in the dust. Oh, dodge so, it? Lane matchups, as we said. Secret got the ones a little bit more that they wanted, I guess you could say. Timber should take over the lane not, soon. Not you can rotate the Dazzle bot. They do have that Timber versus the Beast. I don't even know why he's here. What is this? Yeah. Killer! I'm try and trade with Dakarlis here, but remember this is... Hey, but I hope... Oh, he's oh, dying he heads here? Over. He's, he's got a TP out. I did a... Well, for the TP, so... Jesus a bit of harassment Christ. and drawing Limitless away Oink from... is down. ...waves and away from resolution for a few moments. Bottom lane. Keep trying to get aggro. 
they they're doing a decent job of trying to pressure Chrysalis down. Oh, we are we are so far very away. low in the mid lane. Oh boy. Uh, there's no way he's solo that. Yeah, that's just not okay. It's gonna be very very difficult, of course, with the orb and a phase shift available. He will try for it. And oh, no, won't be able to catch Bihar. We are still gotta be careful. Of course, uh, we have not the tie bring. Oh my god. He does, and also those rotations. Ayat is actually smoked after he TP'd to base. He's, he's got, gonna look for Weha. Uh, he's got the backup of Takar. This phase shifts up. Quick jump forward with the waning rift. He's got the heal, but there's the grab with the dispose, <laughs> and that'll set up for Nisha to take him down. Largest champ yeah, first blood line. against Weha. Oh, oh, we even have to be able to pick up Takalis as well. Here with the X mark torrent combo from Nisha. Oh, kill yourself. It's gonna be both kills. Unless he can get the deny to Roshi. Oh! Takalis will at least be able to hand his life over into the hands. You gotta hand it to oh, him. Oh, what a play by Zayats though, right? The top play, he TP's back, smokes quickly, runs mid, knowing that he wants to play around the four minute rune. I think it's probably Weha telling him too, the right? He's like, suck his dude, dung while I have, or sorry, not Weha, he probably has Nisha telling him, hey, I have Weha sitting at like 20% HP. If you come mid, yeah, you we gotta stop make a move getting a rune, that. he's gonna be screwed. So excellent move there from Zayats. Uh, he's hovering around as well. Maybe seeing if they, they find another opportunity to punish Weha, and of course the second he, he time, that's certainly gonna no. have the orbs been used. They've got to come in with TPs. They cannot afford okay, for Weha nice. to go down here a second time, jump forward. We has got the orb up in a second. We'll get a quick heal from Takalis. Oh. That will oh. allow him enough time oh. to have that orb. That would have been that I would have called it. Jump I back to safety. Oh, very important that Takalis comes in there. We are going yes. down a second time back to back in the lane. That it, it is going to hurt big here. They can just they jump. Strong. A little bit of anti synergy there. Range. The dispose happens. The torrent's actually in the position where the dispose originally was. So they probably would have gotten that kill. From far does connect and give haste to your teammates. That's good design for Alliance. We does survive. I think it's one of those moments where, you know, they, they don't necessarily know, like, the phase shift, the orbs yeah. uncalled out nice, that one extra stack. second, so they, they, they're going to just oh, use no. the Oh, stop, no, stop. to hesitate. Mm -hmm. So this all means, though, that the Kunk is going to get six really early, and they're going to continue to be able to play this he kind of pressure here around Weeha, which could be concerning, because he is really the most important hero to make those rotations around the map. The other cores are very independent, like, are very... He's got more CS because of their camp. They be moving around, so... And yeah, we see there, the link's not broken. No, indeed. It's, it's, in the lane, it's Oof. it's not as great as it maybe would seem on paper. The, no. the time walk not quite got that distance uh, that you would like it but to have. But since said it was good. Against a razor with that link and that chase down potential of the slow at the plasma field. I love it. I love that uh, Wave Zayat's <laughs> playing, honestly. He's just continuing to sit around the mid lane. It's just so happy right now that W33 is making puck, pop look balance. have a rune as well. <laughs> And he knows this is Beastmaster. He knows Rezo is actually just fine top. They might look for a kill on this. It's just a level two dazzle. Well, he's got the setup with the X mark into the boat. Easy. It's going to be a, another kill here for Nisha around this mid lane. And Puppy now also even walks into the enemy jungle and he gets both the bounty runes. So six oh, minutes. Oh, he knows. The bounty spawn. That's now big. The big, 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 Gonna be a good time. Uh, we need to do something said, top you know, now. Punish this guy. Day, so does Rezo. So Dominator is gonna be done any second. Why is he now. fully healed? He's abusing. Gonna make things a lot easier for them to pressure. Because that's why they picked this beast. They didn't have the greatest of tower pressure. Bottom lane. He's still linked. Indeed, again. Mm -hmm. Eco Baby's gonna lose an incredible amount of damage. Uh, it's not starting. Nothing is starting. Crystalis and Puppy. Everyone, calm down. Sorry, Level six puck. We tough. can do some rotation with this. Lanes. We're seeing these setups here from Secret looking. Very optimal. Nico Baby now not really able to step up versus this Razor when he doesn't have any backup. Now we're seeing that big Razor advantage. 15 denies. Top lane. If this Timber so dies. with the three of them. Well, look to set up for some kills up on this mm -hmm. side of the map now. They have the raw thrown down onto Ducalis. Oh the no, Kunkka's coming. Limitless. Of course, very tanky with the three points in reactive. Yeah, not really at a point of the game where Secret as the three. We wanted no 6k so lead at 14 minutes. Nah, he's going to be the uh, one that's to kill. They'll have to bring the Razor one. They'll have to get him like pre one, stacks your mom. the combo because they're quite physical dependent early on. Yeah, I mean, what sort of measures will they be taking to deal with the Timber? Are we going to see one of these heroes go for the Vessel? I don't really think they need to worry too much about the Timber okay. already at this point. Yeah, is he going to die The Timber is one of those where it's like you dominate. If you're going to dominate Fuck hard early, Razor. But as the game Fuck this hero. They will have solutions for you, and I do see those solutions. What the hell is this? Get aggressive. What the hell is this? I can't. <laughs> Desire might die too. <laughs> Just call uh, it. That, that was that was rough. That was it was rough. not they even close. It, it was they not even close. But, uh, yeah, it did. The weather was not great. Crystalis, he had the lightning <laughs> out. And uh, yeah, he's going to oh, be very no. happy. He got pulled back in. in. They get the dispose onto We Are. Oh, no, no, will no. be dodged, but they'll still have a bit of a chase down with a rebound. And Grave will give We Are the chance okay, to jump okay. back to the safety of the high ground. <laughs>
But uh, yeah, that, that bottom lane is going to be rough to come back to. I mean, we're, we're seeing Chrysalis Nico got here. I mean, that lane, was mainly a line. So careful now, Chrysalis just got two kills solo. Yeah, and the thing that what they're doing is actually so nice. And the reason I was highlighting Zayat so much is because what he's doing is he's just shutting down Puck, and now there's no rotations that can happen on the side lanes because Puck keeps getting hit by this. Weha keeps having to go back to heal or dying. Then now everybody's a susceptible That's every single time. Some clean stuff from Secret here. They're speeding Beautiful. it up now. Seven to zero. Two K lead. Pretty much everything outside Limitless. of Limitless's farm and, and, and sort of space. Oh, my the team is top. feeding. It, it, it's been rough for Alliance here in this opening. <laughs> yeah, he should get this kill on Puppy, though. And he's got heals. I mean, Puppy can oh, a little bit TP. more time. He's, he's going to be able to chase him all the way, so it should be a guaranteed kill at least. It's going to take him some time. He'll be able to give himself some bonus strength for the Alliance. second. Yeah! Doing it. Seven, one. Yeah. Long enough. So they do get the kill there. And here's the counter. Here's the counter. Ready, but Desire quick cookie mm. over towards Wee. Breaks him away from any follow-up of Secret. Oh, a lot of gold from the creep. Immediately do back off. After one that was quite a deep attempt. They're going in for the raw beyond the tier one up until the tier two. Alliance won't let them get away with that. Yeah, it just, it just continues emphasis, though. Mid lane, right? Every single time Laguiha shows himself for even one second, they bring three heroes to try to collapse on him. Another D ward just kicking off there, as we saw. Secret, I think that was. I think they got one a mm -hmm. little bit earlier, too. So, Vision, okay, we're right stabilizing. Now for we are actually stabilizing. Of the one ward bottom that doesn't even really protect Nico. It's one good uh, rotation. He might need some help. He's going to go for Should CP out, and of course, nothing at the ready to stop him. So, we'll be able to get himself over to the other half of the map. Wasting one. Alliance, they've got to do their best to keep oh, some sort no, of area no, safe no. for Nico Baby to get this no, farm. No, no, no. Has had a rough start. Those two, you know, the deaths there earlier, putting him in a position where he is the, the lowest net worth out of the cause. So Alliance, they've got to set it up. Mask of Nico madness. Baby recovery. Scary Even thing is too, extra safe point. from. So he doesn't flash farm, right? Dazzle. Razor, Kanka, Beastmaster, all these heroes flash farm incredibly well after having successful lanes too. So Void's recovery outlet is kind of just going to be. Through his team, making we got plays timber, we and got getting timber. back in the game rather than him actually doing much of anything. Because I think if he just comes in and joins, besides with like Snapfire ult with Chrono, he's not really going to do too much. So yeah, a lot of pressure it feels like on Wii, on Limitless. Especially Limitless, I feel. Because he's been given that free lane, now he's got to make something big of it. Uh, Rezo able to put a little bit of pressure on onto this bottom lane. Indeed, Limitless always got to be ready to sort of just sit himself in these positions. The hard lane. Ready to just... Deal with this pressure. Yeah. Make sure that Secret don't get too much of a free chance to head onto the tier twos. Yep. Give the Void the nice easy lane. You take the hardest lane yep. possible. At least slow down the pushes. We want to go mid eventually next on the timber mm. so they don't go for that tower fit. If you see Secret setting up. And we are seeing it. It's all right. It's okay. Set up in the mid. We yeah. high. Got the X spells. mark. But this yeah, we have the grave. The counter. Boat. There it is. The Carlos will have the grave. There's... Gonna be one we talked about from Wehar, and that might just save it nope. on oh, the Tidebringer. That must have been at the maximum range there. Nisha able to cleave down <laughs> Wehar off the hit onto Dakalis. They take out the both of them. Now, see Nico Baby and Desire coming for a bit of a smoke moment. They do have the, the combo. They've okay. got the Chrono and the Kisses. Secret might not be prepared for this, but they have also might be too late for an opportunity there as the Tier 1 has already gone down. Yeah, they have to there be careful, is. though, because if they don't get the Omni inside of it, those heals will come out, and Void won't do any damage because Guardian Angel, if they're in the area. So, yeah. Not going to be able to defend the tower. That's scary already. 4K. Limitless wasn't there to defend in time. I think he had to be there a little bit sooner. Because that tower is so important. And Weeha a couple times now. Using that orb aggressively and getting punished for it. Like, they're, they're, look they were immediate, like every yeah. single time. He uses orb or waning rift or both. And then they just jump him. I did look at this tower bring here. I thought he may have been safe. But it, that must be sort of right on the edge of the, the sort of the cone of the, the reach of tower yeah. bringer. As uh, Nisha was, was able to find that, him. He was so speedy, right? He still had, the, I, bef I believe, the rebound buff. So he was moving like hasted movement speed yeah. on Kunkka. He can get, he can catch up to that orb. Absolutely made the and difference now, there. And now, Orchid's done. So he's bought this item to now make Weeha's life even more miserable. And this time, Weeha won't be the focus. So maybe it will be as well. They try and go for Dakalis, forcing Dakalis to grave himself. Coral's okay. going to be dropped down. They have the kisses. Maybe a chance for uh, some no. kills in return. Oh, they yes. still lose Wee, but they'll take out Zayat. Limitless. Okay, by don't, the we can't have this guy die. Doesn't do very good. Doesn't look like he do, can do anything at Any all. The sun thrown down Team? onto Limitless. Secret showing that they have no problem killing even the timber at this stage. As the chase will continue. Papa ch puppy chucking out the hammers at Dakalis. 12 to 2. Secret continue dominating. To indeed smash this early game. 12 minutes in. It's still yeah. early, but it feels like Secret quite a few steps ahead already. Even a chrono used at the back end there. After the fight kind of goes up, that's why you saw the tip come out. So Nico not even having Chrono now for the next two I minutes. Didn't even where, where did that happen? It was on the south inside the jungle versus okay. I think Rezo. And it was like sort of just 1v1. to save himself. I think it was just yeah. for him to disengage because he would have probably I died. He must have been. But yeah, over and over again, we're seeing Secret there 
putting all that emphasis, shutting down the puck. Now, I think this is the word. I think that key optic caught off guard. I think he thought he was out of range of the Marcy, and then the disposed range because the key optic actually grabs him. So it's going to continue to be a really hard game, as we've been saying for him. And already 6K lead, itemizing to shut down everybody two more. Yeah, it's looking. Looking really solid as we expected for Secret. I've got some very good catch, Secret. Yep. Even 14 minutes. Saying, you know, I predicted the correct. 14 minutes to okay, stay. Right. The orbs used. Oh. Secret there, there to pounce. I mean, 14 well, he, minutes, he just, 7 It K. feels like you can't even use the orb at this point. No. Every time he does Secret, they're just prepared. They're ready to immediately make that move. I, I, I really want to just give a lot of credit. Like, it's Nisha who's doing the, the big damage, it's but Zayak it's Zayak who's doing the heavy lifting of being able to catch him. broken keep hero. This, keep everybody shut down. It's like he's just doing such a good partnership. Holy yeah, with shit, this the I mean, he, he opened up the mid lane right from the start yep. to make sure that Nisha got this lead. Top lane. Oh. Oh. Okay, I have a Yeah, he'd already used all the spells. He had nothing there left to do. He was hiding in the trees. Crystalis, he gets him. Oh, boy. That's a lot of okay. circles on the map there all for right. Crystalis. Maybe some frustration. Sure, is it? Vanable 2 tier 4 secret. It just feels like they have nowhere on the map. Not limitless now. It's not if it's a secret. They're going to commit everything onto him. He's tanky, but not tanky enough. Yeah, they can they can definitely kill him if they press all the buttons, and that's exactly what they do. Yep. Well, they're doing rough. it very well this game, secret. Yeah. Just playing around Nisha. Like, yeah, 6 0 4. Itemizing perfectly. And the game Cheer now. Cheer game inspection it's, time. They're not going to even have the damage. As we mentioned, they have their ult combos. But now their ult combos. It's too late. Everyone has 2,000 plus HP. All the cores are unbelievably tanky on the side of Secret, plus they have healers in the back line. And they even have, I mean, something we didn't even get to talk about is they do have even saves in Chrono. They have Dispose. You Not Shiggy. Yeah, you know I mean, the they rules. Have, of course, a lot of defensive abilities, so right? Much. Puppy can sit at the side, buff you up. Yep. And, uh, One Shiggy. Nisha can just throw down the boat upon you, delay some of that damage that's going to be able five to do anything to, to make sure that even if Alliance do find that perfect five-man combo, might not quite go the way they need it to. Yeah, and I'm, I'm trying to find the ways for them to get back in the game, but I think they've made some... It's 2-16, to 16, obviously, and it's a 10k lead, but I think they just made such crucial uh, errors, at least, especially, like, the mid-tower dropping and just Weeha getting shut down so much. He needs some more help. I, I think they just needed to bring the like, supports or something to sure, offset they, 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 they did have Tukalis hovering around they the did, mid, but, but I think, think they maybe even more. more emphasis, honestly. Like, you need to maybe even bring the snap, sack the void more, because... He was already sacked first the Razor. It's not like you were too much. I'm not sure. I'm trying there to think go. of what the solution is. They'll drop the been. ults here to get the quick kill on Puppy. Okay, okay. We kill we'll a position success. five. The question is if they can get out. The cost will be our position by three. The he will not escape. And looks like Dakarlis as well. will also meet his end here. He'll get the grave off, but the torrent's out. Okay, okay. Dakarlis, nowhere to run. Nowhere to hide. Two more kills for Secret. As that was Alliance using some some of the big ultimates that they do need to, to get these kills. Rezo? Not quite the trade they need. He's just running down the mid, <laughs> ready to go, chasing out We Are. I mean, We Are's got desire to back him up. They will <laughs> turn, and Rezo is getting very Alliance low. Alliance really they will coming get all the way we to the game. Just play them fucking stead. Oh, real dog. He feels bad right. now. Oh, oh, maybe not. Is the ball going to get him? He's got fish. Oh, he's fine. <laughs> oh, living on the edge there, We. Yeah, but he gets out, and they got the kill. I mean, Rezo, he really went for it. Nico. Dispose. We'll do it. That's enough duration to leave him no chance to, to jump any further away. And Zayas now has Blink Dagger also. It's going to be coming on a courier, so even further way to be able to catch. I love that people have finally, I mean, it's been for a while, but people doing this build. Well, you what prefer you? this than the Ether Lens, I do rush. not like the Lens build. Okay. Yeah, I think this build is overall <laughs> stronger Growing in most situations. Just going because to if a you go tournament lens, and pony, being the lapping stock sedge. Potential that you can do. Sure. Lens in this game, though, I could see him even still getting it because we're your versus void, we'll grabbing ripping people, out, people out of chrono and stuff like it's that. True. So, but I, I meant as a, blink as a first item. I like the blink overall just because of, yeah, you can make more plays. And, and also, you know, talk about the void. Four kills nice and eight tower. It gives you that ability him. to sort of you know play the mind games. Exactly. Know, it's, it's not easy. Four nineteen. He could be able to throw down that chrono when he sees you around because you got the quick reactions. You're blinking out before the cast. Theoretically, still winnable. Uh, Alliance all kind of sticking no, together. Not. Feels like this is what they. Have I don't think if Secret point, kind of play as a literally drop unit. dead, they still win the game. Because anyone who shows in a side lane will just die. Weeha. At this point, I think Alliance will challenge to even beat Creeps. Let's see what we can do here. But then, where's the Hawk? It's gonna go scouting. 420 Blaze it. Nah, he's got away. Yeah, he's just out of vision. Should For now, be, unless they keep <laughs> hunting. I mean, yes, 15 seconds on the TP cooldown. Rezo's still gonna search they up saw, here. They saw his mana too. They saw he was low. And then with the ward drop, they've got full vision of him. They got him. As much as he tried to hide himself around there, secret, resilient with their search tactics. They were just 
They really have something out for Wee Hot, feels like this game. <laughs> he's just, like, literally all the attention is put on the puck. But it makes sense because he is the puck, and as, and we, he, yeah. as we said, puck. he was the big playmaker. He had to yep. do a bunch this game if the if the Timber Saw wasn't the one just, like, defending towers all on puck. And I think, you know, a lot of people can very much f feel the same way, you know, with you've had a lot of pucks probably in your game. It, it's, it's one true. of those heroes that when it's out of control, it's out of control. It's very frustrating. That's very true. So, secret, making sure that we are not able to push puck to, to sort of the hero's potential this game. I'm glad that they also like, in a lot of these games, Roche, the, the 11K is stabilizing, that kind of. Either itemize or pick in order to counter it. Nisha going through the orbit, yep. right? They have this emphasis from the Marcy to catch early because maybe their catch could have gone a little awkward if they didn't shut the puck down early. So, yeah, just good stuff from Secret. I get a quick Roshan. Alliance, they are relatively close. I mean, Limitless, he's going to step over towards the pit. See what uh, other we have backups going to be coming guys. in for We have Chrono. Tavalis, watching from the side here. Here it is. If they can start Grandma's something. ready. Nisha's already come the in with BKB. X-Mark boat combo drop down onto the Dazzle. They'll chase Limitless further. Okay, Limitless we got a little Marcy. Away. Was actually able to bring down there Zion. There it is in the combo. Oh, okay. This Pretty is good. coming in as well. <laughs> this is the combo they needed. They take down the one. They'll take down <laughs> Resolution. Okay, and okay. So here in the second life here of Chrysalis is going to be under any sort and of threat. Doesn't look like Anisha's here to back him up. So Secret will still be able to chase down, get Desire. Slowly but surely here with the link of Crystalis. Not, but not bad. Like imagine this had happened earlier. If, if they were able indeed, to get this, this connection. is the, the potential right, yeah. of these heroes. For, for most part of the early game, you hit that Chrono Mortimer's Kisses combo. People are going to die. Uh, but at this stage, yeah, you, you need to ha that to happen a few more times. Exactly. They needed this to happen like every single time Chrono was up from the earlier stage in the game after lanes. But now at this point, yeah, towers all dropping. Everyone's so tanky. Nisha's level 18. Almost 3,000 HP on him too. <sighs> we'll see it again. They've done this, this earlier. Fight. They all have BKBs, right? Like secret, their cores have BKBs, so they just charge through. Yeah, and they were able to, of course, secure that Roshan, that Aegis, yeah. before they were sort of pulled into this fight that Alliance wanted to start. There's the combo that we're talking about. You should tell done, that you are supposed to get Aegis, better after your shuffle not continuously two, so was to and Marla. Puppy going down. And at this point, once you've used the ults as Alliance when you're behind, you got to get out of there. And uh, unfortunately for them, Secret are very good at chasing those that try to run with the heroes they have. Yeah. All things considered, though, I'd say that's like the, one of the best situations that could have probably happened at this point because the, yeah, the game is just looking near impossible because of how ahead the Secret has gotten from the lanes. And just, yeah, their heroes just naturally tank up so nicely mm. versus this kind of limited damage until the later stages when Void it becomes his own damage outlet. Yep. Bring out the he has no buff ups either, right? Like the Void's not like he's amplified at all. So he just needs to have crazy farm fuel to dish out that. And the good news is Alliance has the weak opponents left. We hot. Like they had an ass here. They're pretty good. Yeah, he's ready. But then the other two are very Orchid easy. Into the full combo. It's not going to be quite enough damage straight up with the initial burst. Jump into the trees though. They'll look to continue to search. We are in that little bit of a corner surrounded by those trees towards the wall. We'll give him enough space to hide and jump up the map. Zayats is looking to still chase though. I mean, oh, he's, he's, found he's him. actually going to find him once more, but the orb is back up. Five seconds until the, the TP is available. Weha, surely he's, he's fine. Dude, do, does Zayats and Weha have beef or something? Because Zayats is literally just chasing him the entire game. <laughs> pretty funny. Now, Weha will make it out. See top lane, Dukalis. He's met sort of resolution and his army of ancients here with the Black Dragon. Oh, no. Takes him oh, out. Oh, they found Nico. He has got Chrono who and Tom, who, he hasn't though? actually got a TP. He got, get out? Caught, he got caught from the ward. Oh, that no. top ward, I think oh he's going to die. Oh my god, he's still going to die. Chrono's going to be enough to buy him time to, to escape. Another time <laughs> He's still going to die. Vision he's here upon him with the Hawk. Zayat, oh, no. that blink. Got good chase. Oh no, back no. Up again. You see the wraparound Puppy's coming. Trying. He's ready to come <laughs> in and, and smack him with the hammer here. Slow him down a bit if he can. But Nico, yes. maybe he reads Goes it. Jumps to the side into the trees. Zayat. Meanwhile. He will find him. This is a solo killing versus three heroes. He kills the puck. Uh, how so do, I'll be able oh, to see oh my, out, but indeed the, the two cores of Alliance dead how did again. This farm? Baby, and we Holy are out shit. of the game once more, both out for 40 seconds, no buyback either. It could give Secret some time to, to put some extra pressure onto these lanes, maybe get set up to take that final tier two tower top. Nisha is a monster. Level 21, Bloodthorn finished. It was three heroes versus him, and he just killed the puck by himself. That is, yeah, I mean, this is, as we said, impossible for Alliance. Secret now full control and yeah, back to the drawing board, really. As we said, like Alliance, it's their draft looks okay. It's just, That's of yeah. course, they're versus Secret, which is one of the better teams it, on the roster. This was going to be a tough matchup. Yeah, it's they've got to find something else that'll fix this because they even tried to get the lanes. You know, they'd swap these lanes up to get these matchups, but and so you're sort of 
what you would like to see from them in the next game was maybe more focus on, on we mm -hmm. in the early game protecting his it start must be drunk to, to the sort of keeping extra support down on that bottom lane trying to hold on to the safe lane as long as they did if you are completely reliant on that on like the mid hero making all the plays in the game yes i think you have to put a lot more emphasis on making sure that he has a good game because yeah. now it's like as we've seen the last like what 15 you know for the whole game pretty much because he's shut down their only option to make plays is like a chrono kiss combo because the puck every time he does anything he just gets killed sure so yeah, I think they. I think they had to put more emphasis onto him, but let's maybe go online. He can still do. It. I wonder what they feel right now. So many steps. Like the game is over. Like are they just copium right now? Outside the base secret, very much ready to make the next move. But, but if they go by that logic, they should just GG the second the game starts. So. No, they're chilling. Because the game is they over. Then have also full map control. They have a beastmaster too, so anybody steps outside, they see it. Alliance is. They're not even gonna be able to like, step outside the base. Really, it feels like. No, I'm kidding, of course. Eliza's still good. Though. I still oh, believe in them. Baby almost has BKB. I still believe in them. So at least one thing that will be able to protect him a little. Uh, bit. This game is probably over, though. Still the, the threat of the roar and, and, and all these defensive, these saves that the Secret have are going to make the, the life of Nico Baby very hard in yeah. these team fights. And it's like, where's the damage now at this point? Because they're so far behind. Everyone's so tanky. And there's the Omni <laughs> who has all this healing he'll provide. Yeah. It's, it is tough. Even seeing more itemization, more tankiness coming out for the side of Secret. We are seeing the lens for Zayats, as we mentioned, you know, in the later, you know, after the blink, it is going to be very valuable. A lot of things you can do with it, but yeah, it's Satanics are going to start getting online now for the side of Secret. And yes, yeah, damage is just going to continue to be that issue for Alliance. Weeha, he's the only one who really can venture a little bit out on the Secret know. side at all. I don't know. But even still, he has to be careful. Yeah, as we're seeing. All game there. The I don't players, know. The catches they've had have been very, very good. We'll see it is not even funny, <laughs> sir. <laughs> the spare pain, Nico, is not the nice. problem. Keep it yet. Close towards the face. Lines there. Sides. That's music timing. He's been able to get away with a lot this game so far. Thank you. Play on Nazim. They've got a 15 gifted sub. Yeah, they've missed that. He's right. probably going to miss this situation. Thank you. You've got to go for the wild plays. Yeah. Really deep. He'll he get moves caught. on the map. He'll get caught eventually for one of these plays. Let's see if he's able to get away. They've got the raw. They've got the raw. They've got the damage. Oh, and his team was running to connect too, and now they're spotted. Looks like they did get a glimpse of them for a second because that. Sager, thank you. Around the ancients when they were making the way out. Nico Baby's not the problem. Yes, guys, you're right. If Nico Baby's replaced, the team's gonna be giga good. Yeah, Nico Baby's gonna drop the chrono. Okay. They have got the kisses. They've got enough damage. The save's going to be coming in from Puppy. And he's able to put the BKB in now. They'll look to turn. Been able to take yeah, they tried to kill the boat Kunka, but it didn't work out. On top of Limitless, Nico Baby having to use his last moments of the BKB to jump to safety with the time warp. But Zayat is ready to chase. Nico Baby not able to jump any further as four yeah, dead triple oh. kill for Crystalis. I'm surprised they're not calling it, though. Yeah, that was a good attempt. You know, the chrono there. I think they, they thought that Puppy was a little bit further, but yeah, Puppy gets... Enough, yeah, they, put, they brought him pretty low. Pretty All things considered, that was, that was pretty close. So Can you ask Dream to like give them a Oh, Jesus Christ. Like 3, it was close. It is actually crazy how strong he really is. That is actually, was that right after the 25 minute mark kicked in? So, yeah, that was right after the double bracers as well became just a little bit stronger. Here we have it now up to the base. Oh, yeah. Secret ready to push. Ready to look toward the end of this game. <laughs> so your alliance is able to pull together here for one final defense potentially. Don't worry, we're going to watch, watch Team, team Star as well so we can uh, laugh together when Dream chokes. I'll continue to, to sort of resume with the play that we were for earlier. We are just forcing out this top lane as much as he can. Give some sort of space over on their own side of the map alliance for Eco Baby to work towards that next time after the BKB get some damage online. Uh oh, Limitless. Mm -hmm. See how we know how aggressively Chris wants to die because he may just look to die oh, both of them. Bloodthorn as well. Uh, he's, he's ready to chase a bit more. The cookie will give enough space for Limitless to get back. And look, Zayats is already on the prowl. He's invis. He's already pinging top lane looking for someone to come help him with Weeha. <laughs> Please yeah, stop. The backup TP is coming in, the two of them. Disposed to set things up, or already been used. Been back up in a Why second. Why did they so early? That was very the weird. Time they haven't. Phase shift and a blink out. We are able to get away without that initial catch. <laughs> Getting him. They're going to hunt him all game to again. For a little bit. See how long he wants to keep himself entertained with this. I mean, we are. He's already out with the TP, so we'll manage to make it back to base. So being able okay. to prolong the game and again drawing Secret's attention away from being able to push to end. 
It is Secret's only real thing that they have to do on the map at the moment, though, is stop Weeha from doing this, because there's nothing else that's really happening. That's all. They just have to do that and then get set up and secure the Roche and then end the game. But at the same time, also, that's the only play that Alliance can really do at the moment, also, is just keep the split push and hope for some type of ridiculous play from Eco maybe at this point. Like some huge Chronosphere five man while they're pushing high ground. Yeah, they, they have got the combo online. All Let's ultimates see. to the ready. Seeker's never going to give them that opportunity. <laughs> the see what they're able to do. Uh, they somehow catch Secret by surprise. It's going to be very difficult. We have 45 Chrono. armor on Nisha. They have to respect the Chrono. The tankiness is just, yeah, it's just ridiculous, really. Already see with that first bit of a poke already. Pretty much taking out that melee Rax. And they know that Roche is up too, so they're just going to try to maybe finish this Rax up and just go back and get that get that Roche right afterwards. Chrono? And there's the jump. Alliance Chrono onto the two. The X is already out. Though. Nisha pulls indeed. himself Nisha out. Nisha was prepared <laughs> to get out of that one. How can you pull out of Chrono? One gets disposed, the other one had already X'd How does that make that any was... sense? You just pull your hand in and pull him out of Chrono? It's giving no chance here for Alliance to get the kills against them secret. As they'll take the top Rax. I'll be ready to swing round for more. I mean, as we've seen, maybe with sort of the the hold that Alliance is trying to pull together, Secret are like, all right, you want to keep playing? We'll keep playing as well. Yeah, they don't even They're not to... in any rush. There's no Chrono, no Kisses <laughs> now. They don't even have to back up for the rush. They actually can just probably end the game. It's There's weird. Set of it's weird. I mean, Alliance has really good players. But they're getting stomped. I think they should just keep Even going. in lane there's no, keep, there's no fight for Alliance left. They do not need the Roche on Secret. 100 seconds. Very long time until they okay. have that Chrono ready to go again. Nico Baby spotted on the south side. Their ranks are high. Boat connection down onto Limitless. That's going to be the two supports gone. They'll call it now. We are like rank 31. Secret. Nico rank 2. We'll take this game one. 30 minutes in. 30,000 lead. In fact, even more on the net worth. Secret, they're having a, a pretty nice, uh, nice start Sir, to the day I feel today. bad for yep. you watching. They're, they're laughing at us. My prime sub. They have Beastmaster top in the timber. I'm sure, you they're see the lines. This is us. actually the lanes that they kind of wanted, but I uh, think just things just went astray too quickly. I think Zayats really blew open the game with these early rotations, starting from four minutes, smoking to mid lane, and just shutting down the puck. And then you could see, yeah, the lines. It, it really felt like pretty early on in this game, they didn't know how they could stop this relentless aggression. Losing these towers early, losing full <laughs> map control versus a Beastmaster versus all these tanky heroes. Yeah, just tough stuff. Oh, well, there we go, ladies and gents. I mean, unfortunately for Alliance, another tough game today. We'll see if they're able to change it up, come back against Secret in Game 2, which will be coming up just around the corner. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after the break for Game 2 of Secret versus Alliance. All right. Quick break, then. I'm going to go cry a bit. Be right back. <laughs> 